All right, all right. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. My name is Eric F. King. Happy Wealth Wednesday. Welcome to Wake Up with Eric and uh, Wake Up and Win with Eric and Friends. That's what it is. All right, and today I am so excited because I have a financial guru that's going to share information with you because this is information we need. We need in life and in business. So, uh, Leah, I'll give you a, a proper introduction a little later, but I just wanted to say hello to everybody. Happy Wealth Wednesday, everyone. Coming in to you from California. It is 4 a.m. here, and I am fired up, super excited, and ready to win this morning with you, Eric. Awesome, awesome. Thank you, Leah. Thank you so much. Leah Garcia is just, she is just uh, an incredible, incredible uh, financial expert. And you're going to hear from her a little bit later. Now, you heard what she said, 4 a.m., right? You know, success leaves clues. How many of us would wake up at, actually, she probably wakes up at 3 a.m. to get on this call to be able to share information? That's the kind of person you want on your side, right? That's the kind of person you want. Uh, when you have a financial question, so a leader like like Leah, right? So we're going to get into her presentation in a few minutes. But uh, first of all, I want to share a few things. Uh, for those of you that don't know me, I'm a sales and leadership coach, so I help entrepreneurs triple their sales and boost their income without being pushy, salesy, or sleazy. And uh, this call I do every morning, and it's it's recorded, so most people actually watch the replay. So make sure if you're watching it now send this out to other people so they can see it, all right? And today I'm going to talk about a topic has, which has to do with your finances, obviously, because it's Wealth Wednesday. Now, remember this. It sounds so elementary, but people don't pay attention to it. Money comes from people. Money comes from people. A, a lot of us in business we do everything possible in our business to win, but meet or talk to enough people, right? And we have to realize that money comes from people. If you find yourself always trying to organize your desk, always trying to, uh, you know, uh, uh, put things in order, uh, always planning or, or changing your website or doing all these things, they don't bring money in. Now, my desk is messy right now. I'm not proud of it, but, you know, I'm focused on other things, right? It's not the priority, right? The priority is talking to people, uh, uh, teaching people, learning from people, right? Money comes from people. So 80% of your time should be in front of people, whether you're, you're with one person or you're speaking to a group of people or you do a video that's going to be shared with people or you're on a, a Zoom call with a person or you're DMing some, a person, right, it's, it, you, you should be engaged with people. And because when you do that, that's where you're able to share your value and people will be able to buy what you have, right? Money comes from people. 80% of your time, right, sales and marketing. And then, you know, once you start to generate that income and everything, then you, then you have to organize it, manage it, and then you contact someone like Leah to help you with that, right? Invest it. Right? So three things that help you to uh, build a business, especially online, is called BES. Okay? B stands for build. Build is when you're building an audience. You're building an audience of your prospective prospects, your prospective clients. All right? These are people that are, would, if, if they see what you do, if they see what you do and they have an interest, they'll buy from you right? Like for me, I work with entrepreneurs, right? So my, my, my prospective client typically isn't someone who, um, who works for a company and just maybe works in some area where they're not selling. That's not my client. Even, even if they're selling, it's not really my client. My client is the entrepreneur because that's where my specialty is. I've been an entrepreneur for 25 years. I know their pains. I know their struggles, and that's who I help. So what I do is I build I build an audience. How do you do that? You do that by posting information online that people that can relate to you will, will love to see and will love to, to listen to and read. Okay? You do that by creating events, maybe in, on LinkedIn Audio Room, maybe uh, Facebook Live, 
it's events that draw people to you where you're giving advice, you're giving information, valuable information. And guess what happens when you do that? People reach out to you, okay? Um, maybe you're on a podcast, right? You get on a podcast, you share your information. I get on podcasts every week, right? Um, by doing that, you don't, have not, you don't have to start one. Just get on other people's podcasts. They're looking for guests, right? By doing that, you start to build an audience of people that follow you, that, that see what you do, that, that have respect for you, right? So that's the first part. The second part is engage. You engage when, you, when people send, uh, let's say you put a post up and someone says, great post, or I agree, right? Then you send them a message. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Right? What did you like most about it? And then you start to engage, right, back and forth. Then you say, okay, so what business are you in? And then they tell you what business they're in, right? And then eventually, once you're, once you're, we call it social selling, then you'll be able to say, oh, you know what? I may have some tips for you based on, you know, what I was talking about earlier. You want to jump on a, on a quick Zoom or coffee chat? They do that in Europe a lot, coffee chat, right? <laughs> you want a coffee chat? Like, sure. Then you get on a coffee chat. Now you're finding out their pains, their struggles, and then you present them with an offer. That's the selling part, right? Now, they are way more likely to buy from you because they saw you as an expert. They saw your post. They saw your video. They saw your audio rooms. Right now, they're open to you. They're open. It's, it's warm market. It's not cold, right? Warm market is people that have seen you before or they've heard of you, right? So the conversation is different than if you were just to send someone a random message. Hi, Leah. My name is Eric. I'm a, I'm a sales and leadership coach. Do you want to buy my training or my course? She was like, no, I don't know you. <laughs> right? Like, no, I'm not interested. That's cold. You don't want to do cold. You want to do warm. You want to do warm, right? So, so that's the social selling part, engage, right? And then S obviously stands for selling. And selling is when you provide someone with a solution to their problem, right, where they have no choice but to buy because this, this is what they want. This is what they want, right? It's set up perfectly, right? BES system, 80% of your time should be either finding clients uh, or being uh, uh, building, engaging, or selling, 80% of your time. If you find yourself doing all these other things, you're not going to get to the money, unfortunately. All right. So that, that is what I want to share with you this morning. Um, I also have uh, uh, something special to share with everybody right after Leah speaks, so you want to stick around. And at this time, I'm going to bring up our guest speaker, Leah Garcia from California. Like I said, she is a financial guru. Um, I follow her. I listen to her. I watch her, her video. She had a, a show that she did with this gentleman. Great value. She helps a lot of families all over the country. And so take notes, sit back, take notes, and listen to our financial guru today as she talks about the foundation of your financial success. Leah, the floor is yours. Thank you so much, Eric. And you are just such an incredible leader, incredible trainer, and you are so humble and so giving and truly givers gain. You are just such a value. You're a treasure. To me, you're the gift that keeps on giving. The more I get to know you, the more I just, you're, I can't believe how much you give. You should be charging for this class. You know? Okay. Well, we're going to talk about the four specialists that are the pillar of your financial house. And I've got pages and pages of notes. This could literally be a four-day seminar. But I promise you, Eric, I'm going to do it in nine minutes now. <laughs> So think about this. We are all doing things to invest in ourselves. We're getting up early. We're networking. We're doing our elevator pitch. We're, we're getting on podcasts and studying and all of this. And we're doing all this to what? To go from where we are to where we want to be, right? From where we, where, where we are to where we want to be. And at some point, what will happen is your business will just take off. Your career will just explode. You'll go from zero to hero. And if you do not have these, these four specialists in place, it, it's going to be ugly. You know, that's when mistakes are made. If you don't have the proper foundation, you don't have the proper plan, that's where confusion, stress, and uncertainty happen. And that's where businesses 
can really crumble. Now, I'm going to tell you a story because I never make a, a point without a story, and I never tell a story without a point. I'm going to tell you a story about this business owner. Let's call them electrician. And they're working on their business, and, and I help them, you know, when they first were getting started, and, 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 you know, they're working on their business, and they're working on their business, and they're marketing, and they're, you know, sharing information and building their business. And then one day... They got a contract with the government, and their income went from zero to hero, and suddenly they're making a million dollars a year. And that happened for a couple of years, but guess what? They never had their financial foundation in place. So what do you think happened? They started having some tax issues. They missed the payroll. You know, they didn't, they weren't sure how to properly set up their business. Now they're trying to, to backtrack. And a few years later, it's very tragic, the husband ended up having a heart attack and passed away. I left the wife now trying to figure out the business. Sole proprietor, husband and wife, you know, they had some 1099 uh, people that they would subcontract out with. But here's the thing. They didn't have the foundation in place. So who are the four pillars? Who are the four pillars? The first pillar is a CPA. And you know what? It's not what your CPA charges you, but it's what they can save you that matters most. And you want a CPA that's not a historian. You want somebody who is proactive and, and holistic. And, you know, maybe you say, Leah, you know what? I don't have the money for it right now. I'm just getting started. That's okay because what? We have to, we have, to have the vision in mind. So if you intend to have that income, you intend to build that business, you intend to take your net worth to that level, start now and start having those conversations. So, you know, look up some CPAs and go out and start talking to them, interview them, truly interview them and start asking them some questions. You can ask them, number one, you want somebody who is specialized in the industry that you're in. So it's not as simple as getting a referral from your friend that owns a subway shop and you're trying to build a you know chiropractic business or you're trying to build a sales business right you want somebody who specializes in your industry so number one is ask them do you specialize in my industry or do you know a CPA who does specialize in my industry do you offer and number two is ask them do you offer advanced tax planning right as I build my business are you going to be able to help me be proactive in my planning and you know what number three is really a more humanistic you want to feel comfortable with them because they're going to know everything about you your family your personal everything they're spending your money on so you really want to feel that connection with them so number one is a CPA number two is a tax attorney because you know what, when is the worst time to start looking for a tax attorney? <laughs> it's when you need one. So you want a tax attorney, and yes, you want to interview them also, right? You're looking for somebody who is going to have your best interest at heart and really understand that because these things all go together. They all go together. Number three, because you know what? Well, it's about creating layers of protection. Then you also want an estate planning attorney. It's not about, I see these things and they say, oh, well, it's about a bulletproof this or a bulletproof that. The thing is, it's about creating layers of protection. You may want layers of um, a living trust. It's not a one-size-fits-all, especially as you increase your net worth. And number, th number four is you want a life and health insurance agent who's properly trained and can offer you, um, you know, planning and, and, and will work with your specialist. So you want specialists that are communicating together, that are not operating in their own silos and giving you conflicting results, conflicting information. You want them to be cohesive and proactive together. And when you put that foundation in place, 
then you'll be ready. You'll be prepared. This may take you a day. It may take you a week. It may take you a year to find the right specialist. But you know what? At that time when your business takes off, you are going to be so grateful and thankful because you have that foundation in place. And when you make that million-dollar income, you're going to be able to continue to make that income and not be tripped up by the tax issues, by the planning, by, oh, gosh, what was that, what was that strategy? How does that work? You know, you focus on what you do and let the specialists focus on what they do so that you can leverage that. Right, That's one of the most powerful words of the wealthy is leverage. You stay in your business and let the professionals figure out the things that you need. Let them figure out what can work for you. So I think I did it in eight minutes. (laughs) (laughs) All right. So Thank that's you. what I wanted to share, Eric. Thank you so much for the time. I appreciate it. And I, it's just an honor to share the stage with you this morning. Thank you so much, Leah. I mean, the information you gave was, as my uh, 11-year-old would say, was straight fire. <laughs> it was straight fire. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, do you know what you just shared? It took me maybe 20 years to, know, to, yes. to figure this out. Like, I I just try to figure it out, right? We're in business and we're trying to make money, but it's not just how much you make, it's how much you keep, right? Right. So I I used to hire H&R Block to do my taxes, and I would would miss out on thousands and thousands of dollars of of, uh, 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 deductions and all these things. And uh, I'm like, wow, like, I didn't know. I didn't know any better. But now I know, right? You have to have a CPA. You have to have an estate planning attorney. You have to have a life insurance agent, right? Like you, right? Right. And you you have to have a tax attorney. I have all of that now, but I didn't know. So so I'm I'm so grateful that you're sharing this with people. For those of you that just joined, because um, I know this video will be seen by people all over the world, from the United States to Canada to Africa, all and to Europe. And uh, watch this from the beginning because there's a lot of great information that was shared earlier. And, and, and um, if you don't have the money, because a lot of times people say, well, I don't have the money for a tax attorney. I don't have the money for an estate plan attorney. I, here's what you do. Meet with someone that can help you at this level of where you are, right? Reach out to Leah, talk to her, meet with her, and she will give you the foundation, right? So, so and I, I did a, a video on Stop Making Excuses yesterday on my, on my LinkedIn and YouTube. Right? Don't make excuses like, oh, well, I'm not there yet. I don't, you know, do what you can where, where you are. Right? Do what you can where you are. Start from where you are. And um, that's what I would advise you to do. Start from where you are. Uh, meet someone like Leah who is, uh, who is trusted. She's a trusted advisor. I, I only bring t- trusted advisors to you. Like, I wouldn't, and like, there are a lot of people that reach out to me, obviously, uh, to be on my, on my shows, but, but I only bring people that I trust. Right, people that not just do they have the knowledge, but you know they have the character, they have the credibility, right? And that's important to me. So, and and another thing is, a lot of people don't like talking about money, right? They, I just want to make money, Eric. I just want to help people make money, but you have to learn about money, right. or else you lose it all, right? And you won't be able to help yourself or help people, right? So that's very important. So thank you so much, Leah. We're about to wrap up. Um, I, and for those of you that just joined us, make sure you, you listen to the beginning part. I talked about my BES system that I've used to build a, a, a huge business online. So definitely uh, watch that. And I want to share with you real quick, I have an event coming up on September 20th. It's, it's called um, um, Sell with Confidence. And it's, I've never done something like this before. It's going to be in a huge studio in North Carolina, and I'm going to be taping my course, okay, for two hours. So I'm going to give a lot of great information, but you get it for free. If you listen to me right now before it's September 20th, then you can get it for free. Go to CompassionateCloser.com forward slash masterclass, CompassionateCloser.com forward slash masterclass, and if you click on it, you'll be able to register for free, and you will be in the room, in the Zoom room, and to be able to hear all the information I'm going to share. 
I've you know I've sold over 26 million dollars worth of products and services. I've helped a lot of people do that, do, do some uh, similar things in their business. And I don't say that to impress you. I say that to impress upon you that this event could change your business forever. Okay. So so definitely go there, compassionatecloser.com forward slash masterclass. I just created a new landing page, so you you'll love it. All right. So I just want to share that with you guys. Um, Appreciate you guys being on. Oh, I have an echo there. Okay. Appreciate you guys being on. I'm here tomorrow with another world class expert. Another world class expert will be here with me tomorrow. Make sure you follow Leah. Make sure you connect with her on LinkedIn. And I wish all of you nothing but the best that life has to offer. Make it a great day. Bye bye.